the Tuskegee Airmen all lived in Swigley. So years and years and years ago, um, they, my one customer down here, um, her great grandmother was a part of it. Uh, they got together, I think close to like 20 or $40,000, something like that. To raise money for a memorial. And that is what I'm looking for right now in the Swigley Cemetery. It's on top of the hill behind the hospital. Um, I've never been in the cemetery before. It's like this huge. I think I found it. out here and show you look at it red tails I believe Tusky year memory World War two Beautiful. <clears throat> I don't want to touch it and get body oil on it. That is a gorgeous picture. Look at it. Roll of Honor with everybody's names. Oh, look at the back of it. Wow. If you can read it. <clears throat> Tuskegee Airmen were a group of African American pilots and support personnel who fought in World War II and the U.S. Army Air Corps. This was the first unit of African American military aviators in the United States Armed Forces during World War II. In much of the United States, African Americans were still subjected to Jim Crow laws, and the American military itself was racially segregated. Legal and social prejudice prevented the airmen from flying combat missions despite their ad adversities. <clears throat> Excuse me. The Tuskegee Airmen flew with distinction in 2007, 350 Tuskegee Airmen and their widows received their the Congressional Gold Medal. Western Pennsylvania represented the largest contingent of Tuskegee Airmen in the country.